Hey guys, how's it going? Have round one of 25, the iRacing IndyCar Winter Series at Watkins Glen. I have qualified fifth. Uh, there are 126 entries for this race. Uh, there are 31 in this split. It looks like it split probably four times. People are surmising that this is the second split. Um, I'm in car number 17, so that means by I rating, I'm the 17th best driver in the field. I'm not sure about all that though. Um, and yeah, other new thing that's different here <laughs> is that this is the strength of field race. This is supposed to be the highest strength of field uh, time slot for the entire week. And I've never run in this before. Usually I run on the weekends, but I'm going to be out of town this weekend, so I wanted to get it in on Monday. And I cannot believe the amount of cars that are entered. Uh, it makes me think maybe I need to, <laughs> to run the strength of field a little more often. Um, that being said, this is week one of a brand new series. The uh, brand new series means brand new goals. Um, my main goals are, well, this is all going to be run under the road license, even the oval even. Right now, my I rating is in the 1860s. Uh, I'm hoping to get that up to 2,500 by the end of the season. I think that's fairly ambitious. I don't know how close I'll actually get, um, but that's what I'm going to shoot for. Uh, I also will not accept not having a top five uh, in points in my division by the end of the season. Uh, seems like participation in IndyCar is usually such that. Uh, you know, pretty much you, you finish all the races, you should have a pretty good a pretty good points finish. So that's what I'm aiming for. And then getting the I rating improved should greatly be helped by the fact that there's going to be 12 oval races uh, run underneath the road uh, license system. Uh, so this race, like I said, starting fifth, uh, it wasn't my best lap, but I'm still starting... I'm still only 7 tenths behind pole, uh, and there's 31 cars in the field, so I'm pretty pleased with my qualifying performance, honestly. You can, usually not a very good qualifier. Um, there's so many cars, my frame rate's kind of bad. I hope this video turns out. I hope I don't hit anybody in a frame rate lag thing. Um, in practice, just before the race, I was... 20th fast of 55 people that turned to time, and I was in race trim the whole time, so I'm not sure what to expect. Uh, something else that's different, the number all the way on the right on my steering wheel right now, it's a 10. That is number of push to passes that I have available. And I remember to actually set a button, so I do have some, I do have 10 push to passes at my disposal. The pipe carries in. settings before my next race. Just upgraded to Windows 10 this past week. Frame rates 
not really quite consistent, so I can't quite be going as fast as I want to be. So I'll have to be sure before my next race to, to turn down my graphics quality just a little bit. We got our way up to fourth. We've fallen back to sixth. I'm honestly not too concerned about it. I mean, I'm, my, my I rating would place me 17th. So, however high I finish is going to be pretty good for my, my rating. And after the my race at uh, Sonoma a few weeks ago, I'm much more concerned about just finishing this race. like other people driving off the track. Happens even up at the, tour, at the top of the field, so you just gotta focus on putting in your laps and try to make it the distance. If you do those two things, you should be in pretty good shape. I have a problem with severely overdriving the car and uh, 
using that to help me limit my braking to 50% really keeps me from overdriving the crap out of any car I'm driving. So I, I was hoping there was a way I could prevent the recording from picking that up. Uh, I've looked into it, it doesn't really look like I can. I hope it's not too much of a disturbance because it, it really helps me with my performance. I mentioned strategy yet. Uh, if I have, please bear with me as I repeat it. Uh, planning on needing 34 gallons for this race. So as we came and took the green flag, I had about 17 in the tank, and I will stop and put 17 more in the tank at some point.
any car. I mean, the heel and whatever you call that coming back up onto the track. These are my two worst corners. There's the apex there. Despite my sloppy driving, I seem to be holding Shad in sixth place, about the same place behind me. Rendon in fourth is pulling away from me. Damn it. Uh, uh, yeah, my car is... Looks I'm like toast. Car is toast. You'll need a tow back to pit lane, press and hold your reset button, and we'll come and get you. Well, that really sucks, because I was doing pretty well. Let's get ready for our first stop. I don't know if it was frame rate jitter or, or what happened there, but... Uh, I was doing good. 
and that sucks. It's a way. It's not a very good way to start the season. So uh, that's going to do it for me for this race. I'll see you guys next week at Michigan. I don't know if I'm going to record that uh, next Monday or the following Saturday, but uh, we'll find out, and uh, we'll sit here and see what happens to the end of the race so that we can get the, uh, the highlight reel put out. So thanks for watching, guys, and uh, I hope I don't disappoint you next week at Michigan.